Right, well today's job is I'm going to be doing a K-Rend, but this one is a really awkward job. To get anything near this job is going to be a case of just manually getting it there, because I can't get my van down the lane. Let's get in the van, let's get going. So I'm just on my way to the job now. It's going to be a bit of an awkward one, this job, because I can't actually get my van anywhere near the actual job. So I'm going to have to park it at the edge of a car park, and then I'm going to have to walk it down a lane, and then I've got to go through a house to actually get to do this back. So uh, it's a bit of a challenge, but it's just going to be all down to planning this job. But I'm on my way now, so as soon as you start it, as soon as it seems easier. So this is my job. Super simple. Knock off all the render. Base coat. And K-Rend. I'm just taking the fence out now. I'm going to set up a tower scaffold. And then I'm going to sheet up the roof just to protect it. Ready for knocking off tomorrow. I've got this area done here. So this is all prepared now. Right, so I've just prepared this all now for knocking off. So I've just put some sheets down. I've got some Viscreen underneath it um, for when I'm actually gonna come to putting some base coat on. Um, but yeah, it's all going to plan so far. I've also got a bit around the side that I've just put, um, I've just got a sheet there ready as well. But uh, there's no point in me putting that down just yet. Right, this is basically prepared now for knocking off. Um, I'm not doing the knocking off today because it's given a bit more rain. And to be honest, I just wanted to get this set up first and then I'll get everything else ready. Today was always going to be a day where I had to figure out what I was going to be up against. I'd made my plan, but you don't really know until you have to take things apart. Like I had to take the fence apart just to uh, make sure I had some access. So everything so far is going to plan. I've got a few things that I need to pick up that I didn't think I'd need, but it's best to get things sorted. As I said, there's a few little issues with this job because of access, but as long as you prepare, you're not gonna fail. On to the next day. Right, so today I'm just gonna be knocking off the outside. Stuff's not coming off great, but I'm getting there a bit more now. It's um, the top of it's coming off quite well, but the underneath's been a, a bit of a pain. Anyway, I'll keep on going. But um, it's the end of my day today. I've bagged everything up, um, and I'll get this on to a skip at some point. But uh, at the moment, I just want to go home. I'm dusty and tired. So this job has been a bit of a pain for getting the actual render off. I can't believe how tough it's been. What's the problem been is that when I've actually got to the block work, that some of the block work has actually been blowing through and I've actually been getting some quite deep holes. So what I'll have to do with this is I'm gonna have to put some foam in and then I'll put some sand cement on top of it before I actually start base coating. But that's one of the issues you have when you're knocking off and you don't know what's there. So you've just got to be prepared to actually make sure that it's going to be strong and sturdy and ready for the base coat before you start. So what you can see here is I've got some boards just covering the windows and the sill. This is just basically to deflect any of the render when it's flying off from actually doing any damage. The one thing you don't want is having to sort out a damaged sill or even a plane of glass. So cover as much as you can and just be as safe so that you know that you're not gonna have any damage. <sighs> Finally on. 
just got to get rid of all this rubbish. Ugh. So that's the end of part one. Um, I've done a video on the base coat and putting the mesh on. So there is a link to the description about here. And then uh, I'm going to be doing another video on the finish. And the finish is actually going to be quite different on this video. It's actually uh, not the normal scraped finish back. I'm going to be doing some experimenting with it. Right, so that's me done. Right, thank you very much for watching this video. If you do like these videos, please like and subscribe. I drop these videos every Tuesday. And uh, yeah, I'm really on my way to a thousand subscribers now. So thank you to everyone who has subscribed. And if you haven't, please give it a thought. It would really help. Right, thanks guys. I'll catch you on the next video.